I'm going to show you how to cook a very old fashioned mixed vegetable and dried fish curry. It's called as karatta curry too. For this recipe, I'm using uh, nearly 100 grams of pumpkin, one large potato, I cut it into cubes, and some snake beans, I cut it into pieces and some dried fish you can adjust the level of the dried fish in this curry or if you are a vegetarian omit this and green chilies and red onions and white onions then I have some tomatoes two tomatoes I cut it into cubes for the spices I am using um, chili powder turmeric powder Sri Lankan curry powder then I have some pandan leaves, cinnamon, fenugreek seeds and curry leaves, salt always to your taste and in here you can use a green leaf vegetable or a little bit of cabbage. I am using cabbage here, you can use spinach or any other kind of a green vegetable um, to go with this and some garlic, one cup of water and half a cup of very thick coconut milk. To start this recipe, I'm going to leave the snake beans. First, I'm going to add the hard vegetables, pumpkin, potatoes, and the dried fish, and all the spices, then onions, and the chilies, with the garlic. You can add the cabbage little later with the snake beans. I am going to add the tomatoes at this point and a cup of water and a little bit of salt to your taste and I am going to cook this on low heat about 15 minutes. Once you have cooked the mixed vegetable and dried fish curry halfway through, add the cabbage if you are using green leaves don't add this point it is uh, you can add last minute but because cabbage is little harder I'm adding with the snake beans and mix it well and cook this again about 10 minutes on uh, low heat after cooking the dried fish with the mixed vegetables about 10 to 15 minutes it's time to add the coconut milk this mixed vegetable curry with dried fish is actually just like when you are camping you make something easier that's how they used to do it when moving from place to place and this is a really nice and tasty curry so cook it another 10 minutes with uh, adding salt enough to your taste The mixed vegetable and dried fish curry is ready and I tasted that a bit and it's really really nice and this is a really good idea of having one uh, meal when you are a busy person and you can mix everything and it's well nutritious well balanced too and I hope you will enjoy this thank you for watching